All right, quick video here. Just gonna show you how to uh, install a custom theme uh, into Ableton Live 10 on a Mac. Uh, if you're on a PC and you know how to do this, go ahead and uh, drop it in the comments below. That'd be really cool and helpful for you Windows users. Uh, but here I'm going to download this directly to my computer here. As you can see, I've done this before. Um, and then what we're going to do is just go to uh, our download folder and we've got it right here. So what I'm going to do is just uh, simply command uh, C, just copy that. And then what we're going to do is go into applications, Ableton Live, we'll right click. We've got to show package contents. Then what we're going to do is we're going to go to um, content, app resources, and then down to themes. And I'm just going to double click here. And then you would paste, as you can see, it's already in here, but you just uh, command V and paste it in. And then when you open Ableton, go to preferences, go to your uh, look and feel, and then you'll find it in here. So there's the theme right there. I could go directly to it. And that is how easy it is to install themes. Uh, if you guys got any free themes that you want to share in the comments, feel free to do that. Let's see uh, what everyone's got. Personally, I have downloaded a few themes, but I tend to prefer um, the mid light, which is just a standard, but I, I make it a little bit brighter. So this is it by default. I just uh, bring this up to about 160 in brightness. And there we go. That's kind of what I'm enjoying right now. So hope this helps. Talk soon.